This game is called Looters. So in this game, the idea is the pink team are going to play against the green team. And you have to come out when I say go, collect a ball with your feet, one ball at a time, dribble the ball back and stop it in your box. Anthony, if you could just show us a demonstration. So I shout out, go. He collects it, dribbles it back, stops it, goes and gets another one and so on and so forth. The first game is when all the balls have been collected. We'll count up how many and then we'll decide on who won the game. Okay, you ready? Go! Quilly, 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 who's gonna win it? Who's gonna win? Quilly, ball's still in. One ball's in. Okay, go back to your teams. Okay, count them up. How many? Six, Six against. Okay, greens, one point. Off you go, ball's in the middle, one to the greens. When the ball's in play, not inside the square, you can steal the ball from somebody else. So you actually can challenge them for the ball. Go! If the ball goes outside, it's out. If the ball goes outside the blue, it's out. When all the balls are collected, can't go inside their square. Can't go inside their square. Ball still in. Ball still in. Okay, once the ball goes out, it's out. One more left in. One more's left in. Blimey. Okay, stop. Stop, stop. That was in. Okay, count them up. Okay, eight versus six. That's two points to the greens. Okay, now, listen. What do you think you can do to stop the greens getting so many? Some people go out and take the ball away from them. Okay, so you can challenge them. What else do you think you can do? We can, um, like, have some people just take and some protect the area. Okay, so what you're going to do this time is why don't you send three players and they go and guard their square and then the other three players try and get the balls into your area. Okay, so now you're going to have someone, two or three players defending and then the other three are going to be actually collecting. That means that, that, that hopefully they won't better fill their box. What do you think? A good idea? How about you three go and defend? Okay, you work that out and you get ready. Okay, you ready pinks and are you ready greens? Go! Okay, if the ball goes out the square, it's out. You can't bring it back in. If the ball goes out, it's out. It looks like there's four in each. All right, stop, 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 stop. That ball's out. Okay, go back to your teams, count them up. Five. Five. Pinks win that one. What a good coach. Right, this time, we're going to play for one minute. And in that one minute, you can steal the ball from the other team's area as much as you like. But at the end of that one minute, when I say stop, you're going to end up with counting up how many we've got in each, OK? So simple as that. It's one minute. So starting now, go. One minute, off we go. OK, good. Play, play, play. Once the ball goes out, it's out. You can steal from other people's boxes. Three, two, one, stop! Okay, I tell you what, there's wrestling going on there, there's football, there's every other sport but soccer. How many we got? Seven. Five and seven. Do you know what? That pinks ties it up. That's two, two. What a great way to finish the game. Thanks very much, girls. To learn how Soccer Plus is helping partner youth clubs adopt progressive player development strategies and resources, including a player development curriculum, player and coach assessment, and an in-house coaching education program, please contact Dave Newberry, 